it's the crypto lightsaber back with another video and i want to talk to you about a project that is actually launching tomorrow but before you run out and buy anything like this this is more of a video of caution okay now i'm not saying that this is a scam or anything like that but there was a similar project that had a lot of similarities to this okay guys and i'm going to go through some of those similarities in just a minute but it was actually a scam and it was called radiant finance r-e-d-i-a-n-t and that launched on the polygon network the binance smart chain network and the phantom network i actually didn't do a video about that project okay guys but i did invest in it and um fortunately i didn't really lose much money but the rewards that i farmed i wasn't really able to cash them in all right guys and i actually played it smart and got out of the farm before uh, they actually uh, uh, before the harvest lockup came to an end which i'll talk to you about uh, uh, on this as well because they haven't made it completely clear but you do need to read the documents in projects like this to find out exactly what's going on so please make sure you watch this video all the way through this is not an endorsement of this project this is more like a cautionary warning and the strategy the strategy that i would use if investing in something like this okay because they could be genuine people but in my opinion it could be the exact same people that did radiant finance because of the similarities okay so with this one secure finance okay they're similar similar to radiant they've actually launched both on the polygon network and the binance smart chain network uh, radiant finance launched on the phantom network also okay but that one wasn't really popular not many people bought into that one because phantom network is a little bit more uh, uh newer and a lot less people using it okay so uh maybe the people decided to leave out of phantom network this time because of the uh little the small amount of, of user base that they had there and they've launched only on a binance smart chain and the polygon network but like i said uh it's just a theory okay and it's not absolute okay so if we launch the binance smart chain app okay takes you to the main page all right guys now they claim to be a fair launch all right guys there is no pre-sale for this so obviously you know there's no like reason for you to feel like you would get scammed on a pre-sale or you know you invest in the project and you won't get your tokens or anything like that um this will be pre uh, the, the liquidity will be added uh, uh fairly okay guys from their own pocket of course and um the way that you're going to make money on this is by investing in a token and claiming your rewards okay now it mentions the harvest lockup here which is a similarity to radiant finance radiant finance was the first time i've ever seen a harvest lockup and i thought it was a good idea because it prevents people from dumping the tokens okay a lot of times when people farm and it earn massive percentages as you can see some of the rewards here we got up to 23 million percent in rewards that you can earn okay and when people make those massive rewards what they do is they harvest and they sell they harvest they sell they harvest they sell and what this does is it drives the price down now if there's a harvest lockup it prevents people from being able to sell so frequently okay guys um on radiant there was a harvest lockup of uh, 72 hours uh, to begin with after the harvest lockup um everyone was able to sell their tokens or it appeared as if everyone would have been able to sell their tokens but it turns out those tokens got drained or, or the uh the liquidity was getting drained before people were able to actually sell their tokens and that's just the way i um perceived uh, that it happened especially for the fact that i you know i don't see myself as a an amateur in crypto and you know i was moving pretty quickly to try and sell my tokens because i knew that many people would be trying to sell their tokens and um yeah i also got caught out on that one as well okay across two pools by the way i was in both the polygon and the binance smart chain pool and it happened to me on both of those and the rewards were over well over hundreds of thousands of dollars okay so it did seem too good to be true and that proved to be correct okay so there was also they've got the time lock for the 24 hours or if we go to the documents we'll have another look at what they're actually saying there but you can see there's a transfer of eight percent for each transaction okay guys automatic liquidity and burns and time between transactions in the documents it says a five minute delay uh on each transaction so you can't really sell that quickly so that's one reason for you to take caution okay um investing in something like this you're you're gonna you're not gonna be able to just sell your tokens at at your own free will 
okay, which some would see as a good thing and some would see as a bad thing, okay. The maximum transaction amount is also 200 on his token, so that's something to be aware of as well. Now, on medium finance, um, you know, there was no problem getting in and getting out of the token, so I can't really say much about that at the end of the day. I managed to buy my tokens, I managed to stake my LPs, I managed to withdraw my LPs, and I managed to sell my tokens before the harvest lockup ended, okay? And I anticipated that there could be some problems with the harvest lockup ending, uh, which is why I did it a few hours before, okay? So I was just trying to be smart when I did that. Unfortunately, I didn't lose uh, uh, much money. I believe I actually may have taken a very, very small profit on that, okay? Now, if you look at the farms and the pools, you'll see that it's got very attractive percentages okay now this is not anything that's unusual in the cryptocurrency space especially on the binance smart chain and these kind of newer uh, yield farms on on the matic polygon network okay guys so you'll see that if you pair up the scr token with busd you can get over four million percent almost five million percent in fact no sorry four million percent okay um even on the bnb busd lp you're getting 18 million percent all right guys and on the BNB pair, you're getting 4 million percent and it will be near enough the same on the Polygon version of this uh, project. Okay, guys, so that's very attractive. That's something that will make you think, you know what, I'm going to farm. Okay, I'm going to farm or I'm going to stake. If you go into the staking pools, if you stake the SCR token on its own, you can get 1.5 million percent. Okay, which is really attractive for staking fees, you know, as opposed to... You know, your average is giving you between 200 and 900 to 1,000 percent. This is giving you 1.5 million percent. Okay, so that's very attractive. With a 15x multiplier, you can make a lot of money within a short space of time, especially if you're in very early. Okay, guys, but it doesn't really make any sense if you cannot actually harvest your rewards. Okay, now obviously, like I said, they said there is a harvest lockup, so you can harvest your rewards afterwards. But of course, I'm anticipating that. And I will be keeping an eye on this, but I'm anticipating that when you go to harvest your rewards, that pool is just going to get drained really quickly, okay? And you're going to be left holding a bag that you can't get out of because of a lack of liquidity, okay? Um, with the Rat BNB pair, you can earn 240 million percent. Very attractive, 240 million percent. You know, these are not small numbers, guys. If you stake cake, 401 million percent. And of course, as people come into the pools, uh, that will significantly reduce because you can't actually buy this token yet. It's not gone live yet, but we know that people, if they could buy it early, they will kind of put put it in and just prepare it so that they can uh, uh, start farming and staking straight away when it goes live. Of course, that's not the case with this because it hasn't gone live yet. I believe it doesn't go live until sometime tomorrow. Uh, that's one I was looking at. This not. Uh, let's just go to the uh, Telegram group. Let's just get that up. English. Okay. So, as you can see, it says there's 4,427 members uh, in this group already. Okay, guys. And they've had an audit by TechRate, apparently. Okay. And the um, all the information is here for the launch. All right, guys. The price will be $1.50 on both chains. They will add liquidity on the 13th of July, which is tomorrow at 2 p.m. UTC, which is 3 p.m. my time. Uh, and that will be on the Polygon one and at 4 p.m. UT no, sorry, 2 p.m. UTC on a Binance Smart Chain one and 4 p.m. UTC on the Polygon version as well. Now, that's something that Radiant did as well. They launched them on all three networks uh, Polygon, uh, Binance Smart Chain, and Phantom, and they launched them literally a few hours apart. Okay, so already we're seeing many similarities between the way this is launching and between the way Radiant is launching, okay? Like I said, I'll say it again. I'm not saying it's the same team, okay? But there are very many similarities and a lot of these projects, they are anonymous, okay? So we can only assume who the people are behind it. Uh, Radiant Finance, the team were in the Telegram group and they were very active. They were answering people's questions. They were very nice. Up until the point where it uh, it all went pear shaped, they tried to keep people's hopes alive and kind of keep them interested while they drained the 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 first it was the polygon one. You know they said oh, they blamed it on polygon and they said there's something wrong with you know the polygon network. 
uh, okay and then they did the same thing on the Binance Smart Chain and kept people's interest there being nice to them until eventually it happened on the Phantom Network as well and now Radiant Finance is not doing much at all it was clearly a scam a rug pull okay a very sophisticated one okay and the reason I put this video out is because these scammers are getting very sophisticated uh, you know they, they're very creative and um, the website looks really good okay guys but it doesn't mean that it is legit okay it could well be a scam okay and like I said I'll keep saying this I'm not saying that this 100% is but I will be very careful when investing in a project like this because of the many similarities that it has with Radiant Finance okay Radiant Finance looked really good to me okay it looked really good the fact that they launched on the Binance Smart Chain the Polygon Network and the Phantom Network was really bullish to me and um, them launching on the Phantom Network was extremely bullish because it's not very easy to launch a project on the phantom network you have to jump through lots of hurdles and it gets a lot of scrutiny in terms of audit in terms of you know uh, whether all the bits uh, whether all the pieces match okay guys so there's there's i think that's probably the first rug pull that i've seen on the phantom network although i'm not a very big user of the phantom network but i will say that through my experience that's the first one i've seen there's been some cause for concern it didn't look like it on the surface uh it, the penny only dropped once it all happened okay i'm gonna point out another similarity they have the referrals okay which they also had on medium finance and finally i want to look at the documents okay because this is also going to highlight some of the uh similarities and you know these similarities are more or less exact okay so they have an 8% transfer tax and all that sort of stuff. There is a burn as well. And they're talking about a price floor and all that sort of stuff. Okay. There is the automatic burning of the supply. This anti-well mechanism is the final piece of the puzzle for me in terms of similarity, which kind of makes me think this must be the exact same team because no one in their right mind would fork or copy to a T a scam. Okay. So we have the anti-well where transfers of more than 0.1% of the total supply will be rejected. Okay, now the total supply actually begins at 200 tokens. Okay, but I'm going to assume, um, I can't find it in here, but I know it will be somewhere. Obviously, it is a farming platform, so there will be a mint function to mint more tokens. That's where uh, your projected profit margin is going to come from. Okay. Uh, so of course 0.1 percent of the total supply is not 0.1 percent of two token uh, 200 tokens it's 0.1 percent of the entire supply at the time of harvest okay and at the time of harvest this is going to go into the thousands okay tens of thousands twenty thousands maybe even up to a hundred thousand when you look at those percentages that's what you can do okay guys so um like we said the 0.1 uh, percent of the total supply uh, if it's more than that, it will be rejected. So Wales cannot dump the price and so on. Okay. And there is the anti-bot and transaction limiting. There's a big problem with bots and they take user profits because they are faster. We solve this problem by banning bots. That means no liquidity or sniping, limiting time between transactions after doing a transaction. Okay. And so on. So, you know, they're saying that they've got a uh, anti-bot transaction limit to, to stop that. Okay. And that might apply to me and you okay but maybe not to them okay they, they're gonna have to make their money somehow the previous team in radiant finance so i shouldn't say the previous team but the team with radiant finance they were saying that they've that they're uh, uh they were being paid by the fees um from the farming and the staking fees and all that sort of stuff but guys that's that was just a load of rubbish obviously okay um there's a lot more money to be made from them selling tokens of course so you know be very careful with a platform like this um and i'm only basing that on past experience with radio and finance okay um so they said depositing or withdrawing tokens to the farms will not be subject uh to the restriction okay guys so while the uh uh while the harvest lockup is on there'll be no restriction i don't believe um in terms of the buying and selling how much you can uh, uh deposit or withdraw and how much you can buy and sell um so you know if you are selling outside of the harvest lockup window because when the harvest lockup happens that's when the tokenomics kick in apparently right so uh 
those rules only apply while the harvest window harvesting window is open okay so uh, any time before that you can buy and sell okay you can buy and sell but there is the five minutes before each transaction which uh, does count according to the details um, on the main page of this okay let's just check that again so the time between transactions is five minutes 100 blocks okay guys um, transfer tax is eight percent five percent five point six percent burn two point four percent auto LP and another thing with Radiant Finance is they also had a uh, they also had partnerships and all that sort of stuff going on in the Twitter feed as well. All right, guys. So yeah, I mean, like I said, a little bit of a different video. I'm just sick of people getting rugged. Okay, guys, and you know I've lost a, a whole lot of money. Sometimes people, you know, they come on the channel and they complain that they've lost money. You know, a lot of these times I've lost a lot more. Than what people are complaining about but i don't sit around complaining about it right i'll just move on to the next one okay i've been <laughs> if, if i told you some of the, some of the amounts of money that i've put into rug pools um you know without doing the proper research or even sometimes doing the proper research but it just looked good it looked like this right it looked really good the documents all added up they had audits all that sort of stuff but it still happens guys scammers are getting more sophisticated as each day goes by so i want to warn you just be extra careful okay guys if you are buying a token like this what i would personally do is buy the token yes maybe put a little bit in for farming okay just to see what will happen all right guys but ultimately just buy the token and hold it because inevitably a lot of people will buy the token and it will go up radiant finance went absolutely crazy okay there was insane gains on that token the only problem was people didn't take out their their lp tokens and sell in good time okay guys so i would personally buy the token when it goes up to the moon if you can get in early enough when it goes to the moon you sell and you take a massive profit okay guys and uh of course I don't know whether that's actually, you know, 100% possible if everybody was doing the same thing, especially with these five minute uh, uh, time locks between transactions. OK, so you might want to stay away from it altogether. But remember, none of this is financial advice. I'm not bringing that accusation against these people. I could be completely wrong and you become a millionaire of these massive farming rewards by aping in you make hundreds of thousands of dollars like i thought i was going to make on radiant finance and a lot of other people did and then you find out you know what it was all a dream and it was too good to be true but nothing's really ever too good to be true in crypto at the end of the day there's opportunity out here for all of us all right guys so make up your own decisions all right guys but just be aware of the risks the old saying is don't risk more than what you can afford to lose, okay? Especially on a platform like this. With that being said, that is the end of the video. Guys, if you are not subscribed to the channel, do me a favor and subscribe. Let me know in the comments whether you think I'm right or wrong about this project, whether you think there's massive potential, okay, guys? I'll be keeping an eye on this, and no doubt people will be back to comment on the video after uh, uh, the harvest window ends. Maybe some of you will become millionaires. Maybe some of you will make a couple of hundred grand, Maybe some of you will get completely wrecked or maybe all of you. I don't know, guys, but do me a favor, subscribe, like and comment. I'll see you in the next video.